lots and lots of gifts for my dad. You guys are crazy. We put out the word and you guys sent a hundred, how many notes? 115, 116 notes to my dad. Let's take them to him and bless his big old heart. Mr. Brown, let's go. Come on. Uh, uh, all I need is rolling. I don't want to wear boots here. You gotta I wear like something. I wear my cow shoes. I'm not fighting. Just get something. Here. So many letters. The post office gave us a container. <laughs> What'd you think when you picked up all those letters? Saw them. Um, it made me cry. Aww. Because that's really sweet that all those people that did is that. So sweet. You shaved for me today, Pop? Yep. Sure did. <laughs> well, that's why you look so sharp then. I guess. Well, you're not going to believe this, but we got some gifts from for, from your fans. Oh my goodness, what did you get? 116 letters. Oh, great, Dave. <laughs> Here's from our P.O. Box. You're going to be busy. Yeah, you got, look at this, lots of letters. <laughs> I saw it, honey. You got oh, fan mail. Exciting. Look at that, boo. They sent cards and they sent postcards and they sent gifts. We got gifts too Bye, for goodness. you. I get the gifts, you get the cards. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Her name is Celeste. Uh -oh. And then there's Any more, more pictures in, in there. There's lots of pictures out. somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Celeste is after you. Then we got, <laughs> we got, these are, these people are from Canada. All the way from Canada. This is the Paul. Oliver family. Just all sorts right, of pictures yeah. and get well soon. And oh, look, here's some babies. They sent you some pictures. <laughs> oh, and this lady's name's Ginger. Oh, Wait, Ginger what? got some mail too. I noticed. Oh yes, it was some. Some of it was addressed to you, Boots oh, and Ginger. Yes. Yep. Yes, some very and very nice. This is okay. Kelly and Dale. They sent you a card. So yeah, you've got all sorts of things I can't believe here this. to to look through. Well, that, and you remember Ken Ken Chapel from the Atlanta Police Department? Well, yeah. You met him at the farm tour premiere. Yeah, he, he, sent, he, he one sent you too. one. That's this one. We'll put that right here. Well, we'll have to go through. Them. Yeah, I we guess, got you a whole box. I full. guess I'll have to summarize. That answer was so bad. No. Uh, We'll check in in a couple few days. Because you can't write each one of them. No. You can't. Card. <laughs> no. This custom is a custom cup, cup Pop. Says Same Big Daddy Boots. <laughs> oh, my word. Look at that boots. <laughs> Big Daddy Boots. Stainless steel, oh, thermos yeah. lid. That's yeah. nice. That is awesome. Beautiful. Put your, uh, Beautiful. And then, <laughs> yeah. so see where it says it's engraved with boots right there. <laughs> that is phenomenal. It just awesome. Boy, that is something else. Look at that thing. He was, I think we were chasing each other. Oh, I love you. I love you, I love you, too. Thank you for these beautiful children. Yes, sir. Where's Gideon? This is All of them are beautiful. They are. Thank you. Oh, good. Love you guys. We love you too. That clean shaven face. Take yeah. care. All right. Hey. Hey, don't you need socks? Yes. No, these are pajamas. You gotta change out your pajamas. These are not pajamas. Oh, they're not? No. All right. Are you gonna put on a long sleeve? No. Hmm? I'm not cold. Okay. I'm not cold. Oh, what about some socks? Can I tuck you into some yeah. socks? Down to the sapatos. Okay. Lucky day. What? Just checking in on you. Bye. I'm gonna go move the ices. Okay. I'll check in before milking. It's an exciting day. It rained last night.
Who's there? Gideon, what are you doing? Gideon! I hope he's not bothering mom. I got some extra rest this morning. Woke up at 6.30, got the kids out. <laughs> Went back to bed. Went back to bed. They got to go. They got to start going to bed at night. We've been waking them up. We've been slowly getting into the sleeping in habit. We can control ourselves if we're not tired. We just lay there and be quiet, read a book. They monkeys. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? I don't know. Oh my gosh. She's got no vision. Come on. I was putting somebody to the other collection. Okay, you gotta have goals, honey. What are your goals? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> make 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 work you go. <laughs> Okay. okay. Could you eat something quietly? Yes. And then come help me with the ices. Yes. Okay. Alright, I got 40 minutes until I need a milk. <laughs> then on my shoes like Mr. Brown. I just realized I don't need to feed yet because they're going behind the house. Big move today. We will need the straps. Really? How do they get out so fast? Studs out. They might have something to do with it. There you go. Good boy. So they've gotten down the wrong lane as well. I need to herd them back into this area. They're hungry this morning. Might be one reason they got out. Look at the left side. Look at her left flank. In front of her back leg there. It's sunken in. So we're going to have to supplement with hay today. It's that time of year, guys. Sweater, leaves are falling, leaves are changing. But uh-oh. We fed the chickens on the manure. And normally, they spread this, spread the nutrients out, eat the fly larva that's inside of that, breaking pest cycles. But guess what? Either the manure is hardening, because it's too cold? I did not get shocked. I thought I got shocked. <laughs> or uh, the fly larva, it's not that, it's not acting. Flies are not so the chicken, yeah, they're popping a willy. They got a little excited last night. The chicken's job is done following the cows. It's that time of year. Let's get them on a little bit of a garden job. I think I got this. If it all keeps going well. <laughs> Bad news. Bad news. You're out. You stayed out. Grandpa Chook, you're a bad boy. If he's out, that means he wasn't in because everybody's in. Which means if it's like two nights ago, he was in that tree. So hopefully he'll go to that tree tonight and the boys will come out and catch you. Oops. That's a cut strap. Not gonna be long enough. Hi. Hi. You wanna go with? Yeah. Okay, good. Why did you sleep in my bed? Why did you sleep in my, and not me? Because you don't go to sleep at night. Oh. Well, I did last and, night. Even if I can't go to sleep last night, look, I can sit still. I have a sit still. You want to have a sit still competition? Sure. One, two, two
Okay, all right, well maybe you could. The boy's starting to can't. Jonah, could you and Josiah, Josiah get the cows in, please? I'm out of time. It's 9.30. He said sure. Hopefully by the time he gets them down here, Lily, and set up, we'll have these guys set up. Time out here for a second. First time in years we, we're not going to have a winter garden. We focused on the food we cannot buy or source elsewhere. That's clean meat. It's hard, it's hard to let this go, but we just haven't been able to get to it. We just haven't been able to, other things have been higher up on the priority list and we haven't been able to get to it. The frost got it. The frost got the lettuce. The remains going strong. We can't so, get the rest of the lettuce. If you feel saucy, honey, you could put some hoops over that. I don't even know, I don't, this broccoli's not gonna make it. The rest Too late. The, the carrots? We could cover the carrots. Lily, pick one of those carrots. See how long they are. But it's, they're pretty weak for blood. Are they? Yeah, they're tiny. I don't know how, if we have enough. Things are going to stop growing early November. So a month-ish. I don't know if those are going to get tall enough to overwinter. So as much as it breaks my heart, it's the reality. So instead of that, we've had forested, deep bedded pork, uh, grass fed lamb, uh, grass fed raw milk, chicken, ooh, mucho chickens. What did we put up? Over 300 chickens into our freezer this year. All right, that's their home for a few days. We need to get these gardens covered for the winter. Get rid of these weeds. The chickens can help us with that. Here comes the Animal Garden Miracle. Already had lambs in here cleaning up a little bit. You see their manure. Now we're gonna have add some chicken manure. And Lily, one more. for dramatic effect, let's get the stuff out. I'll leave it open for you, Papa. Let me get the charger out of the way. Okay, ready? Drop it. Good girl. Boy, they've been through it this morning. Let out late. Bunch of you molten, huh? They're going right to work. Eating things the sheep wouldn't even eat. What are you doing, Lily? Getting a feather for the size of feather clutch. Oh, that's nice of you. What are you doing? You want to come with milk? Nah. You're liking that fire, huh? Oh, she's up. She gets some much needed rest. We've been going, going, going. Heck, I slept 10 hours. Hey. Hey. You all right? No, I'm okay. You need anything? Um, no, I got water. How's Sally Field doing? What? How's Sally Field's doing? She's doing great. Hey, look, guys. See how set the chickens up? Yeah. They're on the garden plot? Okay. I did not hook up the Energizer. I don't have time. I'm over. Oh gosh, I'm 25 minutes late milking. Oh my. Okay, will you get I already got your cows. the Energizer? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for getting the cows. Mm -hmm. Will yeah. you guys get the Energizer yeah. set up and the water for the ices? Yeah. The water is out there, but it's empty. <laughs> you get. You're drying off. Okay. You're gonna have a baby. In two months. So we're gonna cut your alfalfa rash. Half for three days. Just a few flies left. See? We're gonna milk her all the way out. 
for the next three days, half the ration. Plus, she's been kind of drying herself off. We'll be lucky if we get a half a gallon. What you making? We're making hearts. Yeah? For what? Yeah. For Valentine's Day. When is Valentine's gonna be here? February. So how many? Days? February 14th. Four months. <laughs> 120 days. How about making hearts for Papa? Okay. And you know, he's sort of bedridden. Let's let's take hearts to Papa. Although Papa's at it, called us this morning. <laughs> he's taking care of business. His sister, Aunt Phyllis, said his mom, I didn't know that about my granny. The doctor called them in on three different occasions to say goodbye. She kicked it every time. She lived to be 101. <laughs> well, hello there, guys. Jonah, switched him out for me. How you doing, Moose? How you doing? How you doing? Hmm? 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 Check your testicles. Okay, they're scabbing over. Not inflamed. You got a good scab on it. That's good. That's good, buddy. <laughs> Don't let me in that area again. You ain't never gonna forget me. You ain't never gonna forget. Huh? <laughs> he says, you stay up here. You stay up here. I'll stay up here. All right? I'll stay up here. I won't go back down there. That's your one bad day. That's the only bad day you're gonna remember. All right? All right? Okay. All right. I'll get you the alfalfa. <laughs> Don't pet me. Just give me a... <laughs> Oh, you're getting the only him too, huh? Thank you, Lily. Pretty little dress. Scooping up poop. Barefoot, too. Well, I'm loving it that we have two cows because we've got. We can dry one off, and we're still gonna be in milk. Doesn't it look like a bomb went off in here? A bomb went off. Then we detonated a, a bomb. What is a bomb? Clean up time. Clean up time. Afternoon. I got a project. This is what we're looking at, folks. We got to get some stuff in here. We got to get our uh, livestock trailer in here, our meat shaw in here, tear down the old sheep shelter. I got those pallets to put right there for our. All our butchering stuff and our tables. How's that for stored away? I think that's good. I think eventually though, we have a permanent setup for that so we don't have to set it up, tear it down. Uh, what, what are all the things we're gonna store in here? Uh, the tractor, the livestock trailer. The other trailer. I think we'll put it in our other shed. And I think that's about it. Oh, the meat oh, shaw. And the pig shaw. I mean. Oh, and the turkey shaw. And the pig thing. Oh yeah, the pig pork. The what do you want to call that? It's not really a shaw. Pig mobile. Pig mo a pig pig yeah. Got this mobile sheep shelter plans off the internet. <laughs> didn't work out that great. Tarp didn't even last one year. We're really liking the sheep shaw. Much better. All right, let's get this uh, dissembled, Jonah. Get your tool. I'll start getting the tarp off. You get this. You start breaking the boards off. Okay. I'm 
what I found. No wonder we can't find Mr. Brown's shoes. They're in the back of the old barn. Hey, 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 we got it cleared. I hate to say it though, we cannot, we can't put it in. We can't put the stuff in. We're out of time. We gotta move animals. Y'all going with? Come on. We're gonna divide this pasture into thirds. One of them is right here. We need to go all the way up for the side fence and then we'll do a daily cross fence. Hey buddy, what you thinking about? Nothing. Huh? Nothing. All right, we got about 20 minutes to have to go in and finish the supper. These boys have been working on the sheep. Where are you going? Did you move them all? Uh-huh. Sheep shot and everything. Uh-huh. Up the steep old hill. Good job. It took us 10 minutes. Let's look. I was, I encompassed this whole entire paddock at the cow farm. Okay. Even all the brush. They were right here. You moved them in there, they're super happy. Yeah, see how the fence is down there in the brush? Yep. Well, this is what happens. Yeah. Hitchhikers, so this is as far as they're gonna get from the from the house. Now this is gonna be interesting, John. How are we gonna get the sheep from there all the way down and through these woods to the other pasture? Just do it. Just do it, he says. How? That's our tomorrow. <laughs> Figuring that out. Sheep from there down to here. If we had three strands on our lane, we could just herd them to the lane. Hey, maybe we need to one up our game and get three strands on this lane. Huh? I just thought we would go like this. How are we gonna herd them down though and not get them in the woods? We'll just haul to them. Haul to them. Okay. Do you think they'll actually go with us? And how are we going to catch them? Mom, we eat with a treat. That's a good sight right there. Look at this. End of day. Look who snuck in. How you doing, Beck? Good. <laughs> you feeling better? I'm feeling a little bit better. Okay. But it was still kind of a, not a very relaxing day. So.